All right, go ahead and start it off on the hardest setting. Here we go. Sir Gareth is a fine lad, sire, but he is still just a boy. You must watch carefully over him as he guides Lynette to the castle. So the Green Knight only has a handful of men at arms and archers. I won't start off with nearly as many troops compared to if I started on the easier medium name. setting. The Red Knight has left three of his most trusted lords to block Sir Gareth's passage, my liege. His route to the castle will not be an easy one. So the crucial element right. of this mission centers around timing right, the troops' right. movements right. efficiently. I'll send off the swordsman first because he's the slowest, but has the highest defense, followed by the pikemen, and then the crossbowmen, and lastly the archers. Is in an awful mood. I don't know why the king couldn't give me a real knight. So I guess Lady Lynette travels with us, As apparently, but at least according to the book, and we're rescuing Lady Leonor. Riding okay, so out. the pikemen will protect the archers, Your and walls. they'll begin to open fire right as the crossbowmen arrive. And I sent Gareth out there hoping the men-at-arms would throw the spears at him, and then miss, and then I call him back behind the lines. Okay, so they're getting everyone. Took up those archers up on the bluff there, good. There's just one more left. Get him. Get him. My lord, sire, Sir Gareth's power lays in the uncovering of traps, my lord. We should make sure he uses it well. Aye, sir. I'm just going to skip Black forward where I've got marks. all my troops lined up. We are your men. Ready? Shoulder pikes. Forward. Your loyal archers. I will definitely not allow Sir Gareth to fight nobly in hand-to-hand -hand one -on one-on-one combat. I will unleash all of my troops at once on the Green Knight in the most unchivalrously English way possible. The Green Knight has fallen. There we go. Zero casualties. That's what we want. It makes the rest of the mission a lot easier. I'll deploy the Eye of Truth and get rid of those traps. My liege. Send out the archers, take out those patrolling men at Command arms. Us. Once more, we march! Are you sure you know what to do with that sword, Gareth? Let's go! What test awaits us? Then I'll just skip forward to where I've got everyone on the bridge. I want to dispatch those two pikemen first. And wait for everyone else to arrive. Attack for his lordship. What would you have us do? Again, this is super critical. I'm sending out my troops and staggering them out appropriately. If I just select everyone in order then to attack, then the archers and the men at arms will arrive before everyone else and suffer heavy losses without the armored troops there to protect them. So as the swordsman crosses the center of the bridge, we'll move the pikemen forward, at which point the blue archers will begin opening fire at them. You order, sire. Moving on. Then I'll select everyone else archers forward. Moving. Beginning with the crossbowmen, because they're the next lowest, and Marcus. the archers and men-at-arms the last. Are ready. So with this strategy, they'll all arrive and begin attacking at roughly the same time. Sent us some reinforcements. Keep your troops away from the rest of the blue soldiers. Our I'll attack them later once I've regrouped with the reinforcements. 
So again, I'll just skip ahead your to that point. Are ready. In your name. Alright, now I've got everyone all in line, I'll send out a single archer to pop off a shot and provoke the blue soldiers to follow him and attack. Out. Good. Our bulls grow and if you time it well, they'll throw their javelins and miss, and the only real threatening weapon they have is their spears, otherwise the men at arms are pretty harmless without lads. them. Sir Garrus, power is ready. And that's why the British fought in line. We are your men. We move. And we'll just do it again. We are on our way. Deploying. Let's get back here. There we go. They threw a couple of them. Yeah, they only managed to get get a few javelins through the lines. Not bad, not bad. You order, sire. My liege. All right. As you command. Command us. Hi, sir. Let's get going. What test awaits us? Normally, I'd send the swordsman out first, but he's a bit wounded. I pledge my allegiance. Battle order. On your command. What does a kitchen boy know about fighting? <laughs> Poor Sir Garrus. I don't think the net is being quite fair to him, my niece. She, she's mean. She's Your mean. loyal archers. Yeah. They'll probably end up hooking up. Guys like the bad girls. Oh no, 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 no. Gareth marries Leonor's. The one in the castle we're rescuing. Unless you're reading Alfred Lord Tennyson, then Gareth marries Lynette. But according to Mallory, he marries Leonor's. So we'll employ the same staggering tactic to make sure our troops survive and all of the enemy troops are eliminated. Get in there, Gareth. Fight. Lord, it is our duty. What would you have us do? The blue of night has been bested, my lead. We'll need to use Gareth's power here again. Make sure not to activate it too yes, far away Lord. from him, because then it will it'll uncover the traps, but it might not destroy them all. You need to activate it right next to where he's standing. That way it will both reveal the traps and destroy them too. Let's skip forward again to where they're lined up. Our lives are yours. Our troops are under attack. What test awaits us? I pledge my allegiance. Lord? Attack! What would you have us do? Marching boots, lads. Your knights are ready. There's only a couple archers. Our lives Not too threatening, but I'll still stagger everyone out anyway. My lord. A tough fight. Stand downwind of me, Gareth. Don't worry, sire. I'm sure her bark is worse than her bite. 
An ally has sent us some reinforcements. Our boars shall sing. Sire, my liege. Okay, let's skip forward As again. You say. There's a couple swordsmen you have to take care of. And uh, I'll move forward to where our troops are positioned to attack the Yellow Knight. So if you look, you'll you'll see these soldiers are wounded. The the bandits go out and either attack the, the Red Knight or Leonor's, but either Wait way they order. end up attacking the Yellow Knight. This so if you're lucky or patient or desperate, you can just let the bandits whittle down the yellow soldiers. I'll send out my men at archers, men at arms for a quick attack at the same time the bandits are attacking, which will hopefully cause the yellow archers to get distracted and then attack the bandits too, not just us. Inaccessible, sire. My liege. We will fight with courage. Command us. Men at arms. Forward. Good. Our boars grow impatient. What test awaits us? How says my lord? Pikeman, advance! You have need of us. Action stations, lads. Get our archers up to on the strategically we helpful. Move. Higher ground. I pledge my allegiance. Steady, man. Now there's only one knight remaining, the red knight, and he's the most strategically positioned, I'd say. In the original story, Gareth needs to fight a black knight too, and the developers were planning to include the black knight in this mission, but fortunately they didn't, because as everyone knows, the black knight always triumphs. Okay, so the bandits are coming after us now, so I need to destroy that camp, otherwise they'll just keep coming. We are on our way, my lord. Deploying, sire. Our troops are under attack. Gotta get a men at arms in there, otherwise the bandits will throw their javelins. Get, get in there. I need to distract him. Sir, ready? Move it! My liege, as you command. An ally has sent us some reinforcements. Ready! Okay, skip forward to where everyone's at the ready. As you say. Okay, destroyed the last of the traps, and then we'll send the archers up where they can have a advantage again. My lord. Right. Yes, my lord. Sire. Woman, on the move.
Yes, sire. Look sharp, lads. Position the armored units up front again. Your command. Our swords are yours. My liege. <laughs> Tink. Makes me laugh. They just landed one wimpy hit on us. Command us. Gareth rides. With a hopeful heart. Setting out. At last, sire, the Red Knight is ahead of us. It looks like we arrived just in time. Forward! What test awaits us? Good. Our bulls grew impatient. Action stations, we'll Take out lads. those Red Archers first. We need to position our men first. Give them an advantage of first attack. I pledge my allegiance. Plus they can start taking out the, that first trebuchet. There's only one archer who's in the, the line of fire for the trebuchet though. Or in range, I mean. Alright, I'll send out a squad of archers up to Leonor's castle. Because if you read in the hints, it says you can commandeer the garrison, I think. Which means you can send your troops into her castle, and then when you move close enough to the, the soldiers inside, their uniforms will Our turn red, and they will join you, and you can control them. Yeah, see, like that. We are prepared. Bowman, make ready. Sire, command us. Sir Gareth's power is ready. Good. Our bows grow impatient. You order, sire. Ready. With heads held high. All right. It's the final climax. I'm sire. I'm sending everyone in now. I'm just gonna Great simply prince. overwhelm the Red Knight Mouse. and his forces. Gareth. My liege, ride with honor. Need to get those archers up on top there. How says my lord? Our strings are waxed. Deploying. Show the weapons. Command us. To battle in your name. You have need of us. Archers moving. No, the red knight I forgot about these archers battle. here. Lady the no, I didn't even need them. Just give us the target. The men are in good spirits. 